Hey everyone, welcome back to a special Mavis Mystery Mayhem episode. So in today's video, I'm going to be unboxing some blind boxes that Kika Goods have gifted to me. So Kika Goods is an online store that sells lots of different blind boxes and art toys and collectibles. And they've also given me a discount code to share with you guys. So you can use the code MAVU to get 10% off your order. I'll leave all the information about that in the description box if you guys want to check them out. So as you can see, I have these two large boxes here. And in today's video, we're going to be unboxing some full sets of blind boxes and then also some individual blind boxes. So today's episode is kind of a themed blind box episode as we're going to be opening up mostly ball jointed doll blind boxes, which I'm very excited about as I've opened up some ball jointed doll blind boxes in my previous videos and I was really impressed by the quality and the designs. So I wanted to open some more and see some new designs from different manufacturers. And then Kika Goods also gifted me some plushy blind boxes. So we'll be opening them today as well. So let's have a look at these blind boxes. So here's the first box. Let's take this set out first. So this first set is the Simon Toys Teen Art Campus Bowl Jointed Doll Series. And I'm very excited about this series as I opened one of the individual boxes before and was really impressed by the designs. So this one's a fruit theme and we have the full set here. So I'm hoping that in maybe one of the full sets we can get a secret design. So we'll have a closer look at the designs in a moment, but let's have a look at what else is in the box. We have some large blind boxes down the bottom here, so let's grab them. So these are the Bunny Fantasy series, and these are the plushy blind boxes that I mentioned. So I opened one of these in a previous episode and thought the designs were adorable. So we've got three of them to open in today's episode as well. Let's put these ones off to the side. And then the other two boxes in here are these bowl jointed dolls. So I think you pronounce this Yun Lai. And whilst these ones aren't technically blind boxes, as you can see the character from the outside, they're also ball jointed dolls and I thought they'd be fun to open up with the rest of the ball jointed doll blind boxes. So these ones are food themed and I know that this company is also making another series which are blind boxes and I'm really excited to see them as well. Let's put them over there. And then the last item in this first package, let's take this out. Kika Goods have also started to sell some ball jointed doll clothing items, which I'll show you guys after the unboxing. And then I'll dress some of the ball jointed dolls in these outfits. So that was everything that's in the first box. So now let's have a look at the second box. This next one has some bubble wrap. So let's take the bubble wrap off this one. So here's the first blind box. This is the Penny's Box Antu Dreamlight Tea Party. These ones are pretty unique as they're actually centaur dolls, which I thought is such a cool design. So we have some of the designs on the side. We have three of these. So we're we'll opening all three of these today as well. And then the last item is this full set. So let's take this out of the bubble wrap. This is also a ball jointed doll series. And this series is called Bonnie the Journey of the Streets. So we have some cute artwork on the front here. We have some more of the designs on the side here. So here are all the items that we're going to be opening up today. There are 20 in total. So let's take the full sets out of the packaging first. So here are the blind boxes, there are six in the set. Let's have a closer look at the designs. So here's the outside of the box. It says Simon's Club Doll and Simon Toys on the front. And here's the other side and the back. And then here are the designs. Let's zoom in on these. So in this series there are six designs and one secret. And the designs are lime, apple, peach, grapefruit, strawberry, blueberry, and then the secret one. So I'm kind of hoping I can get that one as I already have the lime one from a individual blind box. Let's open this box. And let's see who's on this one. Ready, one, two, three. And oh, this is the strawberry design. So let's take all the items out of the packaging. It comes with a little card and this one actually comes with like a sticker set so you can put the little stickers onto the card and like dress the doll. So it has her outfit there. She also comes with some different types of hands and then here's her outfit and there's also some instructions. So it shows you how the different hair pieces work and how the heads are removed from the body and then the outfits as well. And then there's some more information on the back there. And then we also have an extra card here. So I'll probably dress these ones off camera as they do take a bit of time. But let's just take her out of this packaging. So 
So she has some plastic on her head there and then can remove the front of her head. So we can fit this back together like that. So here's her face. She is super cute. Her eyes match the little strawberries on the top of her head and she has pink hair. And then she also comes with some little shoes in the box as well. So I'll put her together and we can have a closer look. So she has a little brown and white sweater and then a red bow tie with a pink jacket. And the jacket also has these silver little buttons on it and a little pocket with a flower on it as well. Let's open up the second blind box. And let's see who it is. And oh, it's the blueberry one. Okay, let's take the items out. So we have the same instruction booklet and then her little card. And then we also have all the extra pieces. So here's the sticker sheet and then her outfit and extra hands. And let's have a closer look at her face. Here's a closer look at her face. She has some really cute purple bow earrings and her eyes also match the blueberry theme. And she also has another bow on the back of her head. So let's put her outfit on. Here's the blueberry design with her outfit on. She's wearing a little sailor uniform and has a little blue sweater as well. Let's open up this box next. And let's see which doll it is. Ready, one, two, three. And oh, this is the grapefruit design, I think. Yes, it is. Here's the information. And here's her card. She has a super cute little sweater, which I really like. Let's have a look. There's the hands and the sticker and her outfit. Let's have a closer look at her face and hair. Remove her head here. Take the plastic off. So here's a close-up of her face. I really like the little grapefruit pieces on her hair here. And she has green eyes. And there's the back of her head. She has a cute little tie with a little orange flower on it. And I really like this green sweater. It's made out of a really like fluffy material. And then her skirt is in a bright orange. Let's open up the next blind box. So we'll open up the rest of the Tina campus later in the episode, but I wanted to add some like variety throughout the video. So this one is the Antu Dreamlike Tea Party. And let's have a closer look at these designs. So these ones all have different names, which I will put on the screen. But from this series, I really like the pink design here, the blue and purple, the green design here. And then there's a secret one that I think looks really pretty as well. So I'm hoping I can get that one. We have a tear tab on the top here. And let's see which design it is. It's the brown dress design, which I can't remember the name of, but I will look it up afterwards. I'll put it on the screen. So we have a little information booklet which again tells you how to put the doll together and take the headpiece apart. And then it also has a little information booklet. This is the other series, which is Natural Wonderland, which I've opened some of these before. And then we have the Centaur series. These are the two secret ones. I really like this design here. And there's the back. And then here's the outfit for this one. And let's have a closer look at the doll. So we have some foam and oh my gosh these dolls are so cool let's take plastic off and let's have a closer look at her face so she has brown hair with some yellow accessories and little bows on the back of her head and then she has some magnets here which i think is where you add the wings so it looks like there's the little plastic wings there let's go out the second one so that's pretty cool i like that they're a magnet feature and then her hooves are made out of like a semi-transparent plastic, which is quite cool as well. And then she also comes with some extra hand pieces. She also comes with a little character card. And there's the back. So let's put her outfit on. 
Here is the center doll with her outfit on. So the magnets work through the outfit, which is quite good. And then she has some posability with her legs. You can move them back and forth and the sides. The tail is posable as well, so you can move it around and up and down. Let's open up this plushy blind box next. So this is the Bunny Fantasy series. And there are six designs in this series and one hidden. So the designs are Cookie, Ice Cream, Good Night, and then Candy, Cloud, Lucky, and Sakura. So from this series, I'd like to get Sakura, Candy, or maybe the secret one. Let's open up the tear tab. And let's see which design it is. Ready, one, two, three. It's the purple design, which is actually one of the ones I already have. But this one is so cute. This one is the ice cream design. And they actually have little hands that you can move around. So let's put their hands into place. And they have little feet as well. And this is made out of a really soft plush material. And even has little ice creams embroidered on the side of its ears. And I really like the eye design for these as well. It's really unique and really pretty like pastel colors. We also have some more little ribbons here, some extra little accessories on the ears. And then here's the back, which has little white wings. This one also comes with a collector's card. So we have the ice cream design on the front and there's the back. Let's open up this Bonnie blind box set next. So here are the six blind boxes. Let's have a look at this one first. So we have some super cute artwork on the front there. There's the side and the back and then here are the designs. Let's have a closer look at these. So there are six designs and one secret and the secret one is the mysterious magician. And then the other designs are all round artist, street skater, fashion leader, proud photographer, hip hop dancer and street artist. So from this series, I really like the street artist design and I also like the proud photographer and all round artist. Let's open up the tear tab. And let's take this one out and oh, it looks like it comes in a blind bag, but we do get the outfit. So, oh, it's the little painting one. So it reveals it with the outfit, but let's grab the blind bag. And let's take this one out. And here is the doll. And oh my gosh, these ones look so cute. Let's put that over there. So it comes with her shoes and ears. And then here is the doll in the plastic. We also have the accessories and clothing. We have an information booklet. So it tells you all the sizes and how to put the head together. And then there's the body. And then here is the little card for this one. So it says Bonnie on the back. And this one is the street artist. So let's take this one out of the packaging. Which can be removed like that. And then her headpiece fits back in. So here's a close up of her face. I love her face makeup with the little like paint splotches on her cheek. And then her hair fades from light green to dark green. And she has a little grey hat, so these are where you can put the ears in. So let's put her outfit on. Here is the street artist. I love the details in the jacket here with all the different coloured stitching. I think it's super pretty. And they're also wearing some little green shorts that has the same green stitching on the bottom. And then they have little white socks and brown shoes. And then also the ears, they can move around a little bit, so you can definitely play around with the posability of these, which I think would be really cute for photos. Let's open this box next. And uh, maybe let's grab the blind bag first. Try and push the clothing back into the box so it can be a surprise. Okay, I think I got it. And let's see what this one is. Ready, one, two, three. This is the fashion leader. She looks super cute. I love her orange and yellow hair. And oh my gosh, she has a like a really grumpy expression and she has yellow and orange hair with blue accessories. And then here are her ears and also shoes. And then let's take the rest of her outfit out. So we have the instruction booklet. She looks 
like this. And then we have her outfit. Oh my gosh, she comes with a little like octopus bag. That is too cute. And then also here is her card. Here she is with her outfit on. I really love this little octopus bag. And I think the little denim skirt is super cute as well. Let's open this third box and then we'll open some of the different blind boxes. And let's see which one it is. Can we tell by the outfit? Oh, it has a little skateboard. So this one is the street skater. Let's take the rest of the outfit out. So this is the street skater design. So it has a red top and then some of the wheels spin. Also says Bonnie there. And let's take this one out of the blind bag. So here's the street skater and also the ears and shoes. Here's a closer look at their face. So this one has grey and white hair and little heart eyebrows, as well as a little band-aid on its face. And there's the back. So let's put this one's outfit on. Here is this skater design. It has a little skeleton on the sweater here, and then also the socks and the sleeves of the shirt match really nicely. And then the little bit of red trim matches in with the sweater and the shoes as well. Let's open up another Andrew Dreamlike Tea Party series. So I'm still hoping I can get the pink or purple and blue one here, or maybe the green one or the super secret. And let's see which one it is. And oh yay, it's the like mint kind of green one. Oh, this one is super pretty. So we have her little dress there, which is in a nice green color. And let's take it out of the packaging. So this one has super pretty pastel like mint hair which fades to like a darker green. And her accessories are in a silver metallic paint. She also has a little semi-transparent horn which is the same colour as her hooves. And then she also comes with the little wings which again are magnetic. Which looks super nice. So we have the two booklets and then the little character card. So let's put her together. Here's the second centaur doll. I think this one is super pretty. The teal dress matches really well with her hair and I love the little sparkles in her eyes as well. She also has a little white collar on the dress which is super cute and then a little wing shape on the front as well. This next blind box is the Bunny Fantasy Poshy series. So still hoping I can get the secret one or Sakura or Candy. Let's open up this box. One, two, three. And oh, this is the cloud design. I have one of the other plushies from this series, which is a smaller one, and I got the cloud design as well, so these will match really well together. This one has a super cute headpiece, which has some pretty detailing on the top, as well as these little beads. And then this one has little yellow details on its hands, and also little hearts on its feet as well. And then here are the ears, and then there's the back with the little wings. Again, the plush material is really soft. This one also has a pretty heart detail in its eye. So let's grab the card for this one. So this one is the cloud design, and there's the back. Let's open up another Simon Toy Spline box. So from this series, we don't have the lime, peach, apple, or the secret yet. So let's see which one's in here. is and oh this one is the apple design there are these stickers and then here's the little card and instruction booklet so she comes with a cute little apple bag and let's take the plastic off this so she has blue eyes and the little leaves are in a gray color and then she also has a little red hat as well. Here's the apple design with her outfit on. So she has a little bag, which is a little apple. And she has a little grey sweater with white sleeves and a black skirt. 
Onto the next blind box, we have another Bonnie blind box. So from this series, we don't have the hip hop dancer, the photographer, or the artist, or the secret. So let's open this one. Let's see if we can tell by the outfit. And oh, I think this is the hip hop dancer. I recognize the cute little pink outfit. So let's take this one out of the packaging. Let's have a closer look at this one's face. This one also has little heart eyebrows, which are adorable. This one comes with a little accessory, which is a little like rabbit themed speaker. Here's the little speaker. That is too cute. And then let's go with the other items. So here is the card for this one. So this is the hip hop dancer. Here is the Hip Hop Dancer's outfit. This one was actually really tough to put on. You can actually move the zipper here, so it does function, but I was a little bit careful about moving it too far down because I wasn't sure if I would be able to fix it if it did come off the zipper part. And the belt here, um, you can actually move the string for this as well, which is pretty cool. I've noticed with these figures, the shoes are quite hard to get on with the socks on, so I might have to try and smooth the socks down a little bit more before I can actually fit the full shoe on. So there is the hip hop dancer. Let's open up the last centaur doll. So still hoping I can get the red or purple and blue or the super secret one here. Let's open up this box. And let's see if it is. Ready, one, two, three. And oh yes, it's the red one or the like, kind of like red and pink design. Yay, so super happy with the sun. This is the little card for the design. And then here is her dress. And let's take her out of the packaging. So she has pink hair and two little buns on the back. And it looks like it's braided here, which is a super cute detail. I really love her outfit for this one. I love the frill and the hearts on her dress. And then she also has a pink semi-transparent tail. So for the wings for this one, the magnets actually come off the inside of the wing. So I have to maybe try and glue the magnet back to the inside of the wing piece. But you can fit it on the top and it will stay like that for the moment. So let's open up the next blind box. Onto the last plushy blind box. So still hoping I can get the secret one or Sakura or Candy. Let's open this one. Ready, one, two, three. And oh, it's the green one. Can't remember this one's name. This one is Lucky, and it has a really cute like bow and heart embroidery on its stomach here, and little green details on the hands and the face, and also on the feet as well. And then on the side here, we have a little bow that's embroidered on and some little flowers and then it also has a bow on the top which is made out of a really soft material and then here's the back instead of wings this one has a large bow so here is the card for the lucky design and there's the back so we have two more of the simon toys blind boxes to open let's open this one next so hoping i can get the peach and the secret design let's open this one up And let's see who it is. And oh yes, it's the peach design. This one is probably my favorite out of the series. So we have the instruction booklet and then the accessories. So here's her outfit, the little stickers and hands. Here is the card for this one as well. Let's have a closer look at her face. So for this one, the hat comes off like this. And then we can take the plastic off and then fit the hat back on like that. So she has green eyes and kind of like a dark pink almost purple hair colour and these little peaches with a purple flower on the top of her hat. So let's put her outfit on. She has an adorable little like rabbit scarf which looks super cute and she's also wearing a little sailor outfit. She has a little navy bow 
and then her sock she comes with a shorter sock and then these additional pieces that you can put over the top and then she has little navy shoes let's open up this bonnie blind box next so we don't have the artist the street photographer or the secret yet let's see if you can guess who it is from the outfit and oh this is the artist this is another really cute design so she comes with a little guitar and microphone and then here's her outfit as well let's take the doll out of this packaging and here are her ears and little shoes here is her face her hair is a gray color that kind of has a bit of a green tint to it and she has red eyebrows and red eyes also here is the card for the design so this one's name is all round artist here she is with her full outfit on so she has a little sweater dress and t-shirt that goes over the top and these little white socks and sort of like dark brown shoes I think this outfit is super cute and it was a little bit difficult to get on. I had to take this section off to get the outfit on as it wouldn't fit over this larger piece here. But once you're able to remove that, um, you're able to fit on the dress pretty easily. And this is the knee joint. You can see it on this one because she's wearing a dress. The rest of them, it's a little bit hard to see, but you can sort of move the joint like this and it snaps into place. Here's the last Simon Toys blind box. This one could either be the lime design or the secret. So I'm still hoping to get the secret one, as I already have this one from an individual blind box. But let's open this up. And let's see who it is. And oh, it's the lime design! She's also super cute. I really like the bag for this one. So here's the little card. Then here's her outfit and stickers and extra hand pieces. Let's have a closer look at her face. So her hat is magnetic, so you can take it off like that. And let's take that plastic bit off there. So she has kind of like teal colored eyes and that match the hat really well. And then she has the little lime slice and these little leaves that kind of look like ears, which are very cute. So here is the lime design. This is actually my original doll that I got from the individual blind box. As I thought, since it's a double, I'll use the other lime design to try out the other outfits that Kika Good sent me. So she is super cute. I love her little green skirt and she also has a green collar and green bow as well. And now onto the last Bonnie blind box. So this one could either be the proud photographer or the mystery magician. The photographer is one of my favorite designs, but I'd also like to see the secret one. So let's see who's in this one. See which outfit it is oh i can't tell so actually let's open up the blind bag first and let's see which doll it is and oh i think it's the photographer i can tell by her hair color oh my gosh her hair is like super bright kind of like neon pink let's take the plastic off there and let's have a closer look at her face. So she also has the grumpy facial expression and she has yellow eyes with this white hair at the top which fades to a really bright pink at the bottom and she has different colored hair ties as well. Here is her outfit. So she has some jeans and a t-shirt. She also comes with the tiny camera. This looks super cute. Is it meant to be like colored like a carrot? I think it's meant to be like an orange carrot and then the little green leaf on the top and then it even has like a little fake screen on the back with a little string that is super detailed and then here is the card for this one so this one is the proud photographer so here is the photographer i have her little camera sitting there and then she has this interesting like little jacket which has these little pockets and i think they actually do open so you could try and fit something in there if you wanted to but they're quite small and oops, one of her ears just fell off. So to put the ears in, you basically just push them in like that and then you can move them around. And then she also has this little denim bit on the back here. And then she also has little navy shoes with pink soles. So here are the last two boxes to open up today. 
So these ones are themed after different desserts and I'll put the name of them on the screen now. Let's open up this box first. Let's take this one out of the packaging. So this one also comes with a little card. She also comes with a little outfit which has the fruits on it. And let's take it out of the packaging. So here is her face, she is super cute. And I love that her hair looks like the dessert as well with the little sticks on the end. Here she is with her outfit on. I love the design for this one. It has a little like cut out sleeve here. You can see the little fruits that are printed onto the dress as well. She also has some little red shoes, which are a brighter red than the rest of her dress and a little bit brighter than her hair as well. Let's open up the blue design next. Here she is out of the box. And then here's the little card. So here is her face. Her eyes and her eyebrows are in a dark like navy blue color. And she has light blue hair with this cool sculpting on the top here. So let's also put her outfit on. So this one is actually two pieces. It's one long skirt and then a little shirt. And this one also has some ribbon details in the front. And she also comes with some little pale blue shoes. So those were all the blind boxes for today's unboxing. So now let's open up this pack of clothes. So we have five different outfits. Let's have a closer look at these. So this first one is a little shirt and then skirt. Here is the little skirt. And then this one matches with the little sweater as well. Let's open up this next one. This one is a similar design, except the sweater is in white. And then we have like a purple and pink skirt. So this one's a little bit darker compared to this design here. This next one is a little dress. So here is the dress, it's in pink and white. And then this one also comes with a little apron and then a little piece for the top as well. And it comes with a little charm. Let's open this next one. So this next outfit has the same skirt as this design here. We have a little sweater. This one is super cute. I really like the pink strap design. And then let's take the skirt out of the packaging as well. Here is the little skirt. And this one has little Velcro bits at the back. This next outfit is similar. And this one's in purple and blue. We have the purple sweater and then a blue and purple skirt. I really like the colours for this one. And then we have one more outfit. Let's have a look at this one. So this one is a green dress and it has little green bows on the front here. And then it also comes with some little pants that have some detailing at the bottom. And then this one also comes with a little green hat, which has some little mini flowers on here. So for today's unboxing, I'm going to try the green outfit on with the lemon or lime design, as I think it will match really well. But if you guys would like to see any of the ball jointed dolls in any of these outfits, then please let me know which doll and which outfit you'd like to see, and I'll post them on my Instagram. So let's dress this doll in the green outfit. Here she is with the green outfit on. I think this one matches really well with the little lemon or lime piece up the top here. And then the dress also has two little gold buttons here as well. 
So I'll have to find some shoes for her. I might use the original shoes that she came with for the moment, which are a yellow colour, which are these yellow ones. But I think Eco Goods also started to sell some doll shoes as well, so I'll definitely have to check them out. So that is everything for today's unboxing. Let me know in the comments which blind box was your favourite. And if you guys want to check out Kika Goods, I'll leave all the information about my discount code in the description box. I hope you guys enjoyed watching and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!